hey 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 what's going on what's happening your az reload plug is just sitting out here on the patio right now and i'm just taking in uh, the warmth of the air just appreciating air conditioning for one <laughs> As you can see, my face is shiny. So just taking in and appreciating the air conditioning that's on the inside. However, enjoying and reflecting on the days and years that I used to love being outside. I mean, it didn't matter how hot it got, I stayed outside. Whether it was jumping ropes, riding a bike, hanging out with friends, up and down the street. I really, really used to enjoy being outside. And I live down south. So we talk in the humidity. But as a kid, you had no idea. And even before um, I moved to Ohio, I lived with my grandfather and he didn't have air conditioning. So after high school, um, I spent a little bit of time um, in college over at his house and he did not have air conditioning. Okay, he didn't believe in it. Okay, they had an air conditioner in the living room, but nobody was gonna turn it on. Okay, no one was allowed to turn it on up until the day he died. He didn't care for air conditioning. so. Um, as a young boy, he was a sharecropper, so, you know, he got married to my grandmother really young, he left home, I don't recall him telling us, sharing a lot about, um, his childhood, but it must have been pretty rough, but, um, he was a hard worker, and the heat didn't bother him, so I am... Um, getting to the point to where I'm trying to um, push myself and elevate, you know, my body chemistry to being able to tolerate <laughs> uh, the heat again. So I know saunas are very good for you. Obviously in Arizona, it feels like a sauna at 100 degrees in the evening, even when the sun is down. I just wanted to pop on here and have a quick conversation, um, seeing what everybody's into, and um, just out here meditating, thinking, reflecting. I uh, just had some watermelon, and um, I finished my walk earlier with my husband, and um, it's been a week, y'all, let me tell you. It has been a week, so I'm learning so much in my new career of real estate um so i've been licensed two and a half years and i'm still learning i'm still growing and um i'm starting to realize that you know you have to really have contracts in place you have to have commitments uh from individuals in place because you could be helping somebody for free and then they ghost you disappear all of that so um just learning some hard lessons and uh, realizing that as my grandfather used to say you can't be too nice to people you cannot be too nice it truly does not pay uh, it truly does not pay it will put you in the poorhouse it will put you on the streets so um just some hard um hard lessons uh, that i'm learning but that's okay. I'm learning, okay? And I'm open um, to learn. So I'm not gonna let it burn me. Uh, I'm just gonna learn what I need to learn and um, implement and execute what I need to implement and execute to get going. So um, this is my little chat. <laughs> so y'all be blessed. I'm gonna go ahead and get off of here, but um, yeah.